Good morning, teacher. Good morning, teacher. Good morning. While waiting for the others, we're going to watch some videos first. Good morning, Rasa. Good morning, Nabdun. Good morning, Baibun. Good morning, Paje. Welcome to your class. Good morning, teacher. Good morning. We're going to watch a video first while waiting for the others. Teacher, I have a gun. You have a gun. I'll tell you. All right. So that's it for our video. Did you enjoy the songs? Yes, thank you. Now we're going to study science. We're going to talk about misusing soil. That can be seen in page. 170. 170. Are you ready to learn? Yes. Okay. Teacher. Yes. Pig. Page 170. Oh, my camera's off. Ready? Yes. All right. So let's begin with our class. Okay. Wait a minute. All right. So let's begin. Uh, we're, talk we're going to talk about misusing soil. Soil is a useful and important natural resource for human life. It is the start of the four important human needs. The food, sure, the clothing, the shelter, and the medicine. Soil gives us a home for plants to grow, right? We plant on the soil and also it gives us water air and food to the plants soil is a home for some animals and microorganisms some animals live on the soil some animals live in the soil or underground as we get more people on earth we need to use soil more when we use soil wrongly or incorrectly it makes the quality of soil to fall. And here are, the, here are some of the examples of misusing soil. The first one is cutting trees. Alright, the first one is cutting trees. Repeat after me. Say, cutting trees. 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 Okay. Without trees, the surface of soil is easily destroyed. So, when we cut trees, the soil, the surface of the soil can easily be destroyed or broken. So, cutting trees is bad. Cutting trees is a way of misusing the soil. Now, can you repeat it again? Say, cutting trees. Cutting trees. Cutting trees. Very good. The next one is too much use of chemicals. Too much use of chemicals. Using too much chemicals spoils the nature of soil. When we use too much chemical, okay, since there's um there's a lot of chemicals that we put in the soil, it will spoil the nature of soil. Okay, can you say it? Too much use of chemicals. Too much, too much use of chemicals. chemicals. Okay, the first one, number one is. Cutting trees. Cutting trees. The second one is too much use of chemicals. Too much use of chemicals. The third one is shifting cropping. Shifting cropping. Okay. Burning destroys the soil surface and its nutrients. When we do the shifting cropping, uh, shifting cropping, we will have to burn the burn that part of the land. And if we burn that, it will destroy the soil surface and the nutrients in it. So shifting cropping is not good for the soil if we do that we are misusing the soil okay next next example of misusing soil is non-eco-friendly waste non-eco-friendly waste 
what is non eco friendly waste okay when we do and when we when we put waste on the soil that will that will break or that will destroy the soil okay all right okay let's review the number one what's number one cutting trees cutting trees very good what about number two too much use of too much use of chemicals very good too much use of chemicals number three shifting shifting cropping shifting cropping shifting shifting cropping okay so we have three already ready yes very good so we have number one cutting trees number two too much use of chemicals number three shifting cropping and number four non-eco-friendly waste okay say so non-eco-friendly waste very good oh, remember those four okay okay and of course we don't just remember the four ways of misusing soil we also remember to not to do them okay don't do those things okay do not cut trees okay do not use too much use of chemicals do not do shifting cropping and do not um, contribute to the non-eco-friendly wastes. So since we already know how to miss, uh, um, since we already know the waste that we do in misusing soil, now we are going to learn how to take care of soil. So how do we take care of soil? The first one is by plowing and adding organic fertilizers. Okay, when we add um, organic fertilizers, when we add organic fertilizers um, to the soil, it will help to, nutri uh, to give nutrients to the soil. And also, we should, uh, when we do plowing, it will also help to provide, um, to help the soil become better. Okay? Number one, plowing. Say, plowing. Plowing. Okay, remember number one, plowing. Number two, ladder farming on hillside. Ladder okay, you can just say ladder farming. Ladder farming. Oh, okay, because when we do ladder farming, it can slow water from running down. So therefore, it will help the soil from being washed away by water and weed. So it helps, okay? It's not just beautiful in our eyes. It will also help to... Uh, um, to prevent the soil from being washed away okay so ladder farming number one is plowing number two is ladder farming remember okay number one say um plowing plowing number two ladder farming ladder farming okay number three growing vetiver grass growing vetiver grass Okay, when we grow vetiver grass, it can help better the quality of soil and make it moist. And of course, when it moist, the grass also stops soil from being washed away. When it moist, it's better for the soil, okay? Because it will absorb the water. Okay, so growing vetiver grass. Say growing vetiver grass. Growing vegetable grass. Okay, that's number three. Number one is plowing. Number two is ladder farming. Number three is growing vegetable grass. Very good, growing vegetable grass. Number four is crop rotation. We can add nutrients to soil using crop rotation. Okay, for example, we can plant peanuts and then soybeans and rattle pods. They are good for crop rotation. Crop rotation kids means changing the crop or changing the plant or vegetable that we plant in that place. Okay, so instead of, for example, you are always planting mustard. Okay, so instead of... Um, 
always planting mustard, you can also try to plant peanuts, okay, or soybeans and brattle pods, okay, because they are good in um, their roots will be good for the soil, okay. Next one, okay, let's review again. Number one is, number one is, growing, growing, number two growing. is, Leather farming. Leather farming. Leather farming. Number three is? Growing vegetable grass. Growing vegetable grass. Number four? Crop. Crop rotation. Crop rotation. Good job. And number five is? Growing ground covered plants. Okay. When we grow ground covered plants, it will help to stop soil from being washed away by water and also by wind okay through soil erosion and will also make the soil moist okay because the moist of these plants will help the soil okay okay these ground um ground cover plants will will help the soil okay it's good for the soil so we should also do it remember okay if we do it it won't um it um it will help to prevent being washed away to prevent the soil from being washed away okay that's called growing ground covered plants okay you can just say ground covered plants okay say after me ground covered plants ground covered plants Okay, ground covered plants. Ground ground covered plants. Okay, what is number one, everybody? The Q is raising. Yes. What is it, Nampun? Someone is raising their head. Oh, what is? Uh, I don't know the name. Q. How Q. Q. Why are you raising your hand? Do you have any question or anything? Oh, maybe maybe he just pressed it accidentally okay so what is number one growing 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 okay growing ah that is plowing 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 okay number one is plowing number two that's a farming that's a farming number three growing Vetiver. Vetiver. Very good. Growing vetiver grass. Number four. Growing crop rotation. Crop rotation. Very good. Number five. Growing grass. Growing grass. Growing grass. Ground what? Ground covered plants. Okay, you can just say ground covered plants, okay? Very good. Okay. Number six is building draining ways. Okay. When we build draining ways, it will help stop the land from being too wet and then fall apart. Okay. Because there is um there is already a way of water or waterway or draining way, it will help the the soil to not get too wet and suddenly fall apart. Okay, this can be seen in page 173. 173. Teacher, what's book? Science book, score, science book. Okay, let's continue. Okay. Tishilan, Tishilan. Tishilan. Why is One hundred seventy-three. Okay, let's review from number one. What's number one, everybody? Plowing. Plowing or plowing? Number two. Leather farming. Leather farming. Number three. Growing vegetable grass. Growing vegetable grass. Number four. Crop 
Round cover plants. Number six. Building growing waste. Building draining waste. Very good. Yes, po ba? Good page. Page one hundred. Oh, we're finished with now one hundred seventy-three. So now we're going on to page. Um, 172, 172. Ready? Yes. 172. Okay, so here we're going, um, we're going to describe the low quality soil, okay? What can we see in the low quality soil? Okay, we can see that the soil is dry, hard, and cracked. So those are the characteristics of low quality soil. And the next one is the better quality soil. So what is the characteristic or what are the characteristics of the better quality soil? It, it is crumbly, crumbly and dark in color. So that is a better quality soil. Pinch what page? 172. Finish, teacher! We need... Okay, let's wait for the others. Teacher, I just raise my hand if you are finished? Again, what is it? So, can I raise my hand if you are finished? Yeah, sure. When you're finished, please press your press the raise hand button. Is everybody finished? No, no finish. Finish. No, finish. Yes. Okay, let's wait for the others. No finish. 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 No finish. Finish, Tisha. Is everybody finished? No, 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 no. Finish, Tisha. Tisha, let finish. Tisha, may I go to the toilet, please? Sure. Finish. Finish. Is everybody finished? Finish. Okay, I think everybody's finished. Nobody's saying no. All right. So now let's go to the next part. Okay, so for the conclusion, we found that adding dead plants and animals to soil helps boost soil quality and also makes the soil become healthy, absorbent, and large species so that water and air can pass through well. Teacher, what we Saint Peach, one hundred seventy-two. Teacher number one, no be. Okay, let's wait. Let's wait for them first, and then when they're finished, we're going back to number one. Okay, finish this part first. Number one, no finish. Ah, uh, this one first, and then after this, we will go back to number one. Finish. 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 Okay, let's wait for the others. Finish. Finish. Okay, let's wait for the others. Your friends are not finished yet. Number one, no finish. Yeah, we will go back there when we're finished with this part. Finish, finish. Finish, finish, finish. Let's wait for the others. I can still see somebody writing. Finish. Everybody, everybody finished? Yes. yes. Me too, finish. Boom, finish here. Number one, boom. Boom. Let me see that. No, can you can you take a picture? Thai cap ba. Đập cột pum pit khuyên cặp pum cột ở thằng app ba. Có cột pum mà cắt thả thả. À finish. Okay. Okay now boom. All right so for your for your homework. With page page one hundred seventy two. Oh. Yes, 172. All right. Today we learned with our written activities written about activity. um, we learned about the things that we do for misusing the soil and also how to take care of the soil. And we also had some written activities about it. I hope that you learned something from Teacher Lance today, and I also hope that you enjoyed this class. If you're finished writing the homework, you can say goodbye, dear friends. Bye, kids.
Bye bye, teacher. Thank you, Thank teacher. You. Thank you, teacher. Bye bye. Yeah.